Russians in Crimea are actively looking for Ukrainian partisans. As the National Resistance Center of Ukraine reported, the strengthening of administrative and police conditions for fighting against the Ukrainian underground continues in occupied Crimea. The enemy is concerned about the activity and increased effectiveness of the resistance movement in Crimea, as a result of which it has strengthened the counterintelligence regime, including for the purpose of identifying and combating the Ukrainian underground, National Resistance Center said. At the same time as the resistance movement on the peninsula stated, during the past month there was a tendency to increase the average daily output of civilians crossing checkpoints controlled by the Russians on the administrative border between occupied Crimea and Kherson Oblast, amounting to about 15,000 people a day. The Atesh underground resistance movement based in Crimea stated that the Russians were transferring their air defense systems to occupied Simferopol. Our agent has recorded the transfer of an OSA air defense system and Russian troops towards Simferopol. This is an old system which has been in use since the 1970s. The invaders are forced to reuse outdated air defense systems because they are not even able to protect their military facilities in Crimea. More modern systems, in turn, are being systematically destroyed by Ukrainian forces. We are also making every effort to do so, Atesh Underground Resistance said.